In this video, Sam is gonna show you how you can replace your downstream O2 sensor on your 2007 Toyota Prius Hybrid. Today we're gonna to be replacing the downstream O2 sensor, which doesn't look like this, but it should. It should look like a sensor with something these wires connect to, but somebody was down here before doing something they weren't supposed to, so it's not. Instead, this is an 8mm Allen plug, which you're not going to normally see, so. If for some reason your toilet looks like this, this is how you're going to fix it. I'm just going to pop off this plug. And if it's seized, we can do, you may get burned a little bit, but who cares? He's got to turn the engine on, let it get nice and hot. So that way, you know, the threads expand, will come right off. So it's going to take this plug out. Which is probably why it has a code for the downstream O2 sensor. See that plug was getting hot. And then if you follow this up, you can find a wire connector. Well, it looks like this gets booted into something, but either way, it's going to take your new O2 sensor. This is what it should look like. But as you can see, it got cut. Just going to take this little tie thingy off of it. Now there's like this. You can take your O2 sensor here, put it in, and just start threading it in. And normally you're always going to want to disconnect it before, just you know, wires don't be twisting on up and stuff. But then that means while it's out, you know, the wires, they can twist freely. So we just got that twisted up, but we're just going to act like that didn't happen. And once you have it snugged up in there. All right, so now that you put your little two socket on, you can use a 7 8 wrench. So you can use a 3 8 ratchet then. Now just tighten it up. Yeah, it's tight enough. And now... I'm going to want to chase this wire up to wherever it goes. Seems to be through here and maybe in the cabin. To remove the front carpet panel, you want to remove this inner door trim, which just comes off with clips, as well as this trim piece right here, and then peel the carpet backwards until you can get to the connector, which is through the floor right here. And then you'll see this little plug in here, but so I didn't know what they were doing. So now you just go here, like any other connector. Just unplug it and drop it down through here. Now we can feed the new one up. See it? We can go on ahead, push it here, click, give it a you know, tug test. It's not coming apart, and you're good. And that's how you do the downstream sensor.